Lakeshore VIP Access. I'm so thrilled to be catching up with these amazing people. I'm here today with Ali Simpson, and Tom Simpson. Simpson. <laughs> We're here today at the 2017 Nickelodeon Kids Choice Awards. So guys, there's a lot going on here at this awesome event. What are you looking forward to the most? Um, I mean, I'm looking forward to seeing who gets slimed tonight. I think that's always fun. Um, John Cena is always an amazing host, so I'm excited to see what he has to do. Well, I'm excited for the slime. Big question: Are you guys ready to get? Oh no, no, no not at all. <laughs> it's like no. I'm definitely not. I, I never am. I mean, I've been slimed once or twice. It takes me like three days to get out of my hair. It's it's a tragic time. I was hoping Tommy would be like, yeah, I'm for it. I'm for it. But I was like, no. I was like, nope, I look good today. Ain't nobody slimy me. <laughs> well, you've been doing so many excellent things as well, like hosting for Radio Disney. So tell us about that. What it's like working on your show with Radio Disney. Yeah, the show's been going really well. I've been over at Radio Disney for almost two years now. Um, it's like it's like one big family over there, honestly, and um, been really awesome to me. And it's, it's a great platform for me to voice my opinions every week and to have amazing guests on the show. And I've had some pretty awesome guests uh, as of now, so it's been really fun. We love your show. You always do such an incredible job with everything. Now, guys, we're going to do a very quick slime or save speed round. Are you guys ready for it? Okay. Slime or save your brother Cody. Slime. <laughs> and also slime or save John Cena. Slime. What about slime or save Camila Cabello and MGK? Um, save, because Camila always looks really cute, so we'll save her. And uh, MGK looks really, really awesome in his uh, suit jacket tonight, so I'm not trying to mess them up. Girl, you're all ready to slime everyone. She's like, slime everyone, but not me. <laughs> and also, if you had to bring out a message, all of your fans, what message would that be? I'll start with that. I mean, my message would just be like, thanks for sticking around. I mean, I've been in this business for a really long time and had my ups and downs, and I think I've had those those few fans that have really stuck with me and are sticking with me still today and waiting for the new stuff that's coming this year. So I'm honestly entirely grateful. Really, really grateful. Who are you, Tom? Oh, I don't really have any fans. No, you have so many. Are you crazy? Everything you guys deserve, everything. But thank you so much for having me.